So once again, good morning and welcome to our weekly morning charge, holding every Monday to Thursday. It's always been very, very powerful. Um, and um, on this channel, it's very good that you subscribe to this channel. So you might want to click the sub subscribe button right now and also the notification button so that every time there's a new video, you can always just, um, you know, get notified and use it and just start listen to it right away. My name is Jake Knox, and today I'm going to start, I'm starting a seven week series on the seven skill to build a multi-million dollar organization. And yes, it's possible because these are not skills that um, are just, um, that exist at the imagination level. These are real skills that have turned ordinary people to extraordinary people. These are real skills that people have put their hands in, okay, and put their business to run with, and they've, and they've come up with really great results. Okay, so, yeah, so let's go. Now, the key to long-lasting motivation is strong for the mental skill, right? Now, it is, it's very hard to see the forest in the tree. And that's quite very deep because um, when, when, when we show you an 18 months roadmap and we're saying, we're talking about the, the new work order, work for 30 days, okay? And we're saying um, just two people, it's enough for you, okay, to, you know, to get a minimum of $300,000 or more, okay, 18 months or less. I mean, it's a very simple model. I mean, everybody sees it. But, but it's even as simple as it may sound or as simple as we tend to explain it or expatiate on the possibility. I know somehow, you know, people or perhaps you still find it very hard to see the forest in the tree, okay? Because you know that the forest we see today is just, um, one tree, you know, giving birth to more trees. Okay, and that's it. And before you know, boom, it's a forest. So it's really very difficult, and that's why a lot of people, you know, they, they give up halfway, or I know even halfway perhaps. Um, some people, you see them darting from one point to another. Okay, they're not consistent, they're not, um, they don't follow to the end. Okay, they're they are always here and there. Okay, because for them, they're looking for a forest. <laughs> Unfortunately, guys, nobody's gonna hand, hand over to you a forest. No, everybody starts with a tree, and that's it. And that tree is you, you come on board, okay? And your tree starts multiplying, okay, following a simple principle, just two in 30 days. All right, and, but now what keeps, your motivation, okay? One of the things we've identified is that the key to long-lasting motivation is strong for the mental skill. When you have the skill, when you uh, master it, when you are aware of it, when you use it, okay? Uh, it's just like, um, I have a cell phone right now, I click the call button. I know, I, I'm clicking, I know that when I click the call button, Okay, it should ring, I should doubt somebody on the other side, okay? And if for some reason it disconnects or it doesn't connect or, you know, I know for a fact that, yeah, I did what I should do. The network is it's poor, or, you know, it's not my, it's not about me. It's about the system, all right? Yeah, that, that's it about skill, you know, when you, when you have this fundamental skill, okay? And then you, you, you can control your results, okay? You can not just control your results, okay? Your, your results, you are not emotionally attached to your results, okay? Because you know for a fact that if I do this, this should happen, all right? Now, I just put up a very simple mathematics, okay? Um, I just call this like a success equation, okay? Um, you have a goal right now, okay? Because the, everybody's goal is unique to him or her, okay? So you have a goal, and if you add skill to that goal, okay, you get like success, okay? So in this case, we can say goal is like destination. So you want to move from point A, all right, to point B, all right? Moving from point A to point B, 
you are aware, listen, you know for a fact how point B looks like, all right, which is your destination. And that destination could be, okay, out being, you being out of debt, that destination could be, okay, you, okay, changing your neighborhood, having residual income. You know, yeah, that, that destination is very clear in your heart, it's very clear in your, um, in your goal setting book, okay? So you, you have all of this written out, you know, it's very clear, it's clear, it's, it's clear, it's defined, okay? But uh, you also need a map to get there, you need a roadmap. You need a roadmap. Just like me, I want to leave where I am today. I want to leave where I am today to maybe a second destination. No, no matter, no matter what I want to get out of that destination, if I don't have a, you know, a clear roadmap, if I don't have a defined or apart from it being defined, if I don't have uh, the right roadmap, okay, with me, I mean, I mean, I'm, I mean, my, my, I would never get there. So when you are, when you add your goal for skill, you get success, which is like fulfillment, okay? Success is, is just basically fulfillment, okay? So now let's look, we're looking at the missing piece, okay, in the puzzle, which is the map, okay, of us to get there, okay? So now what's the goal? The goal, okay, the goal is just two in 30 days, that's the goal. It's very simple, just two in 30 days, and everybody's like, okay, just two, just two, but you're wondering, a leader in this call is wondering right now that, oh, I did my two in 24 hours, or perhaps seven days, or perhaps 18 days, okay? Why is it that people in my team, you know, can't get this? Why can't they not just, why can't everybody not just do their two in 30 days? Okay, so somehow, okay, you tend to like, feel, okay, there is a goal, okay, the goal is defined, okay, we're clear about it. Everybody, myself, everybody in my team has got this goal in heart. And the biggest question here is, what's the roadmap? What's the skill we need in getting this goal? It's getting to our goal so that we can get fulfillment. Okay, so our, our RSP has defined the goal for you. It's very defined, very defined. Everybody knows about it. But now the missing thing is how to get there. How do we get there? How do we get there? What's the roadmap? Okay, so we're gonna talk about seven skills. Okay, so I call them the success skills or perhaps the golden skills. So the first skill is finding prospects, all right? And um, this is a very, 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 I mean, it's, it's, it's perhaps it's responsible for 98% uh, reason why most people don't uh, join our business model. Because the biggest question is, do I know anybody? I don't know anybody, you know? And I don't know, I mean, sometime in your life, perhaps you, you were faced with this question in your heart, do I know anybody? Okay. And, um, but think about it this way, we have over 7 billion people in this world active. I mean, we're, I mean, active, it means as people are dying, you know, people are coming in, people just clock 18 a while ago, people just died, people just clock 18 yesterday, some people just clock 18 today, some people are gonna clock 18 tomorrow, you know? So it's a continuous channel, you know, when people keep telling me, oh, this tree stop at some point, if everybody in the world gets it, I said, listen guys, stop looking at it like, oh, Think about it this way. It's like drinking water. And you say, can we drink water up to the point that there's no water for us to drink again? No, you drink it, it we, you know, we pass it out again. It goes back into the earth and it comes back. That's it. So it, it, there's never a time that, okay, it's going to get so full that there's no other person to come with. No. <laughs> no, people are clocking the team. People are dying. People are coming. That's it. So that really validates the fact that the tree, Okay, you can never, never run out of people. Never, never. Otherwise, think about, do you know how much of, of the oil that we'd be using, okay, to drive our cars and whatever, you know? If oil is finishing, it's getting finished, for example, they're exploring new 
energy forms like electric, you know. So the energy, you know, it's like in, in, in physics, it's that energy cannot be destroyed, okay? So that's it. So don't ever think that, okay, our model is such that, what if everybody? That's why yeah, people say, oh, I came in late. No, guys, no, guys, no, guys. That's not how it works. So the first question that comes to mind of every prospect is, do I know anyone? You know, if you can help the prospect from a list of people in their head that they may be able to place in their organization, that will become the place for them. Okay. So, prospects always say, do I know anyone? Do I know anybody who, and some people say, yeah, I know people, but I don't know anyone who will be interested. All right. So, we're going to be dealing with all of these objections and, you know, offering solutions and ways okay you can actually you know play around these things so the first skill is finding prospects finding not finding people but finding prospects okay and there is a way you qualify people to become prospects there's a way you convert ordinary people to become prospects Okay, for somebody to move from the people equation to the prospect equation, it's information and that's it. Okay, so today, for example, you are fired up at this, okay, on top of this, because there was some time in your life, okay, you heard something and that transformed you. You heard something and that, you know, that turned on the lights in your heart. Okay, so we're going to be showing you, okay, how to turn on the lights in the hearts of the people, how to turn on the lights, okay, in their thought process. Okay, so, so that's it, the first one. Next thing is inviting, all right? The key to inviting is not to hunt your prospects. And inviting is a whole lot. Some people think inviting is just about inviting people to events or inviting people to Zoom meeting, you know. Inviting could be, Inviting someone to see a video, okay? I love what uh, I saw. I don't know if I can show you really quick. I love what I saw um, just recently um, this week. Um, I mean, that lady was really very smart, okay? Let me show you what she did here. Yeah. She, look at what she did. We posted a video, okay, about Marius calling a spike on Bitcoin, and it actually happened. And Bitcoin made over two thousand dollars in addition. You know what this lady did? This lady tagged a lot of her friends. Wow, yeah, that was very creative. And everybody has access to this: our Instagram page, our Facebook page. You know, so whenever there's a post, you can just come in and tag your friends in it in the comment section. You're inviting them to look at something. Okay, so invitation goes beyond just um, inviting somebody to a meeting or a, or a Zoom. You know, it's, it's part of that, but it's more than that, right? So we're going to show you how to do that. So you don't go around looking for every single living person and tell them about your business. The goal of inviting is to educate people on what you do. Educating people on what you do, that's the biggest goal, okay? The more people that understand what you do, the more your business will grow. It's very simple. So you, it's, uh, it just, I, I wish I could show you a conversation on WhatsApp, but unfortunately I can't hide the person's name, okay? But we had a conversation yesterday and, and all I did was just invite him to send him that uh, video, you know, Instagram. Automatically, most times they follow, they start following our pages immediately. All right, so, you know, so I'm gonna be showing you how to, uh, you know, play around these things, you know, engage your people, keep there because you don't want to get out of their face, you don't want to get out of, uh, you don't get out of their eyes, you want to be in front of them every two, four, seven, but now you're doing it in a very subtle way, you're doing it without affecting your day-to-day -day routine, all right, so the more people that understand what you do, the more your business will grow, all right, so that's one of the reasons why a lot of people can get their two thirty days because they don't know how to do these simple things, okay? And we will actually put up a table, show you exactly you know, how to do this. Number three is presenting. The largest obstacle in presenting is understanding that you are not the issue, 
All right. Now I tell you why I say you're not initiated. You know, I, 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 one of the reasons why a lot of people can't present is they'll say, "Oh, okay, I've not made twenty thousand dollars. I've not made fifty thousand dollars. Oh, okay, I don't have a, you know, a nice car to show. Okay, to the guys that. Like the biggest question here is, now what are you doing to get that twenty thousand dollars? Nobody, nobody would write a twenty thousand dollars check and say, "Oh, take twenty thousand dollars into your account and now go and start promoting with the twenty thousand dollars." No, anybody who has made a hundred thousand dollars, two hundred thousand dollars, million dollars, someday didn't have a dollar in his back office. Some of them didn't have a car, didn't have a nice apartment, didn't have nice clothes, designer clothes on. So that's it. So. The biggest problem is why you think you cannot present is because you keep focusing on you. You're thinking you're going to present yourself to the person. You're not the person changing that problem. You're not the opportunity. Okay, you are not the opportunity. You keep saying it, you're not the message, but the messenger. Okay, and the messenger has to make it so clear through our through the science of our presentation. I did a video, the science behind the $500 presentation. I'm surprised that that video has less than a thousand views up until now, okay, after about three months. And we have a whole lot of people in this community. And somebody tells me, I don't know how to present. I've been taking time to watch the science behind the $500 presentation. I explained the science behind every slide. Believe me, guys, anybody, in respect of who you are, in respect of what you've got, in respect of what you don't have, if you can go through the science behind the family dollar footage, it will help you, okay, in getting this permission over. Remember, if the prospect can see themselves within a successful business, the presentation is complete. That's it. Trying to get the attention, trying to personify, you know, that personage, okay, put them in the picture, put them seeing them buying the right coin, you know, put them, seeing them, you know, take advantage of every spike and every dip, or most of the spikes and the dip, you know, putting them in that position to be able to see, okay, the $300,000 or more in 18 months or less. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna um, deal with that. In short, last year I did, I did a series on language, okay, and I mean, just a content on my YouTube channel, so that's why I said you need to subscribe to that channel and spend time to watch those videos and rewatch watch them again. You know, share it with your team members, new ones that come on board. Let them watch those videos. Right? It's very powerful. Now, follow up is another skill. There are a few concepts that surround follow up that cannot be ignored. Concepts like number one, do what you say you're going to do. Number two, the only reason to have exposure is to create another one in the future. So usually what we do is, when I have a conversation with somebody, I always, what I call a BAM farm, B-A-M-B-A, -A, uh, sorry, B-A-M-F-A-M, -A BAM farm, book a meeting from a meeting. You confirm them, that's follow-ups, okay. So right now you've seen the video, when can I check on you? So you can check on me on Monday night, um, 9 or 8, 8 p.m., which works for you. Say 8 p.m. Okay, great. Straight up, what do I do? I come to my phone. I come to my phone. And this is my calendar. It's really full, guys. <laughs> it's really full, you know. So I'm getting reminders. Okay, okay, I need to call uh, Mr. Akira Zach right now on, on this. And right on that call, you know, maybe I try to reach him. It's not better, but I write him. I said, okay. It's in line with what we agreed, okay? So um, I think could tomorrow work for you by 10 o'clock or 11 o'clock? I'm not going to tell him when next will you be available. I'm, we'll be giving him options and time. And I try to be definite when you're following up. So I'm going to show you all of that, you know? So it's very simple. You just use a calendar and it's simple. Okay, it's very simple. Yeah, three. It takes, usually it takes about four to six exposure for the average person to join. Okay, they may want to, understand Bitcoin better, you know, they don't want to understand how the trading works, they don't understand how the RSP works and all of those stuff. So usually you can have that in the back of your mind, all right? Then um, number, uh, let's get this off. Then uh, number 
Number five is conversion from prospect to subscriber. Okay, the key to success in this area is to having good posture and asking good questions. You know, and there's a skill in converting them, getting them to commit. Okay, so I'm gonna show you that conversion, how to convert them from prospect. Okay, you are taking them from people to prospect, now from prospect to subscribers. Number five, conversion. So teach you the act of asking questions. I mean, I did a series the other day of uh, last year on questions and the answers, okay? So there's some, I mean, there's a whole lot of material right in this channel that you can actually plug into. Yeah, so number six is setup, okay? So, and that's where a lot of us miss out in it. We just feel when somebody comes on board, our job is over. Yes, so it's like, think about it this way, as a mother, is your, is your job just to get pregnant and put to bed? And you say, I've put to bed. The child should take care of himself. No, when you put to bed as a mom, okay, you're gonna spend months, years, okay? Even as old as I am, for example, my dad still wants to check on me, okay? He, so during that period, there's a period in which I, the child can't talk, okay? So I can look at the face of the child and, I'm able to guess or second guess what's in the heart. If the child needs food, um, if uh, the child is hot, okay, so that's it. So that's how it happens when people come on board to your kids, okay? And when we say kids, I'm not looking at their age, their kids to this concept, the kids to this community, the newbies, okay? There's a whole lot, they, they, they're excited, they're, their mind is like a tabula rasa, you know? It's just, Plain, it's open. Now it is your job to fill it up. Fill it up with the right stuff. Okay, the right stuff. So I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to establish a new piece. It's a big listen, this is one of the biggest growth tools you can put your hands on. Otherwise, you end up just being a recruiting machine. Okay, but the deal here is not for you to do more. The deal here is for you to have more people to less. So keep that in the back of your mind. The deal here is not for you to do more, to be a recruiting machine, no. The deal here is to have more people do less, okay? And in order to achieve that, you must be a master in setting up people, in establishing them, in deep rooting them, okay? So there's some highlighted points here, validate your new subscriber's decision, help set the expectation, tell them what you and others have don't get started, you know, let's start up, let's get started, guide, help your new prospects, okay, subscriber, create a game plan, rank plans, give specific assignments. This is very powerful. Now, number seven is promoting, promoting. Okay, it always works, it always works, it has great impact on the team. And um, for example, um, when, I, when I started this presentation, I talked about, uh, uh, what's going to happen uh, on Saturday. On Saturday, I will be having a live meeting in Lagos at Proti Hotel. Um, I'm doing a video shortly, okay? And uh, the thing for that meeting is where is the money? Where is the money? And uh, I did say that um, there is no shortage of money in this world. There is no shortage of money, okay? And money never comes to you, you go for it. So this is gonna be a very big, big, big event, okay? That's gonna happen, okay? I'm gonna have a time with the subscribers, I'm gonna have a time with the prospect, okay? So yeah, so you should be promoting this on your WhatsApp story, you should promote it on Instagram, okay? You should be promoting it everywhere, all right? Where's the money? If you change your DP and all of those things, what, I mean, I always tell people like, uh, what, what are you using your, your TP for, right? You have um, a two Bitcoin challenge going on right now. And somebody's gonna work, up, work out with perhaps $10,000, okay, by March 1st, right? So the biggest question here is, how many people in your team are aware of the, uh, the Bitcoin challenge? How many people in your team are aware of it? You know, so, that's it. So you've got to promote this kind of stuff to get everybody 
okay, to do what they should do. Promotion is not more than sharing useful, um, useful information about the community, all right? Promote, get people to, you know, promote the handles, get them to subscribe, uh, follow, follow us on Instagram and Facebook and Twitter, all right? The challenge going on, okay, push it, explain to people, tell them to do, I mean, have you heard about our two Bitcoin challenge, how you can get $10,000 if you're about? Do you know how to get ten thousand dollars guaranteed by March first? Okay, then now I'm going to explain how this is going to work. All right, so that's enough presentation. So yeah, promotion is another very powerful skill. So um, yeah, so thank you very much for um, this today. Okay, we're continuing tomorrow. There's a whole lot. Okay, so I'm going to be unpacking this, and it's really going to be very great. So once again, I said subscribe to this channel. There's a whole lot you can learn from it, um, and yeah take it up from there. So thank you very much. Do we have any questions? Thank you.